the North Pole lies at the center of the Arctic Ocean. The area is permanently covered with shifting ice marked by pressure ridges. This ice pack is between 3 and 4 meters thick, with ridges that can rise to 20 meters in height. The constant movement sometimes exposes open water. Around the fringe of the permanent ice is much thinner seasonal ice that melts every summer. The northern polar ice pack ranges from 9 to 12 million square kilometers, but satellite observations indicate that the extent of polar ice is diminishing. The ice sheet covering most of nearby Greenland extends across an area slightly less than 2 million square kilometers. But because the ice here can be as much as 2 kilometers thick, there is more fresh water locked away in this region. It's here that researchers have been focusing attention on the increasing rate of ice loss. By measuring the depth of meltwater in lakes across the ice sheet and associating that with their shades of blue, they are trying to devise a way where satellite observations of lakes' colours can yield an accurate measurement of the volume of meltwater. Most scientists agree that the polar ice is receding, but predictions about how long it will last vary greatly. During the summer of 2007, the loss of Arctic sea ice exceeded predictions. The ice flows had dropped 40% below 1980s levels and 20% below the 2005 record minimum. Since 1993, an increase in the number of glacial earthquakes across the northwest of Greenland has led researchers to believe that extra meltwater is causing the flow rates of the glaciers to accelerate.